Hey guys, Kev here, and I'm gonna do a full review for you. This here is the Nike Joy exclusive Esnix Beer Buster Junior. Uh, you may have seen this uh, in a couple videos of mine. I absolutely love this knife. Um, gonna be honest though, I'm gonna sell this knife. So this will probably be in the knife sale that should be done by now. Um, and it's really more about me than it is about the knife. And I'll get into that, but let's start off aesthetically. I think this thing is sexy. It's just got something to it. It's got that traditional sodbuster look to it. Uh, obviously it has this bottle opener on the back. Um, I love the little nail nick. Uh, I love the beer bottle on here. It comes packaged in a beer can. Like, get the f*** out of here, Knife Joy. That was awesome. Um, Esnix is a, I believe, custom... Uh, he does custom like slip joints and stuff, I believe. And then he worked with Knife Joy to bring this to reality. It is a production model made by Riot, who I love. You guys know I love Riot. It's black micarta and M390, pretty standard stuff. Got a clip on here, a 3D mil clip. It's a little tight, I will give it that. It's a little bit tight and annoying to get in pants. I feel like a lot of people are probably just gonna pocket this anyway or throw it in a slip, but. There's that, excuse me. I love the aesthetics, love the black micarta. Ergos, guys, I got a large glove size hand and this thing fits my hand really well. I mean, I get all four on comfortably, I feel good. I got my thumb all the way up here. I got full control of this blade. Uh, the Ergos are fantastic on this knife in my opinion. I was very surprised. I thought it was gonna be too small for me. Um, carry, like I said, that clip is just a little bit too tight, but it does work. Goes in pocket, comes out relatively easily. You do have a little bit sticking out and you got that bottle opener sticking out. So if you run your hand the wrong way, <clears throat> it might catch you, but I carried it in my back pocket. I had no issues. You can also fifth pocket this bad boy. Carry, pretty good. It's lightweight, weighs like two and a half ounces, maybe three. I don't know. It's light. Um... What else? Cutting, guys. Whoosh. This thing is an absolute cutting dream. Um, you got a almost full flat grind M390 belt satin from Riot. And this thing is super slicey. Uh, check out, I think Nick Stasa, Stasa23, did a video cutting with this. Um, I would recommend checking that out because I absolutely enjoyed cutting with this. It cut out my shipping labels real easily, little pinch grip. Yeah, it has kind of a clip point, but it worked pretty well for that. And it slices paper and cardboard and gets into packages and everything real, real easy. It's real nice, Clark. Um, so yeah, cutting's great. Uh, sounds, I mean, love the sounds. Really kind of rockets out of there with that front flipper. And uh, closing, just a little thud. I like the sound, it's like a seven out of 10, maybe a six. It's not really loud, but it, it I like the sound. You know what I'm saying? Uh, cut and carry, action, aesthetic, whatever, ergos, action. <whistles> Guys, left-handed, easy, easy deployment. It has that Pena style of uh, top flipper, front flipper, which is awesome. Um, I have had more fun with this knife than any Pena I've ever had. Even the Lanny and the large uh, Swayback. It just feels better. I don't know what it is, the detent or what. You can also just hold it like this and do the reach around and drop the knife in the car. Shit. Of course, I probably smacked the edge. No, got lucky. He got lucky. If you're gonna buy this, don't watch this. I'm just kidding, it's fine, it's fine. Um, it's cause I'm holding it all weird. I've never dropped it before. Now I'm like afraid to do it, but there. Um, you just <laughs> do the reach around. Um, yeah, it's fine. Um, you can do it right-handed. You can do it left-handed. You could do the top. You can do, I can't do the rolly thing cause I've never been able to do that really. Uh, but it's just very fun to play with. Like I just sit there and whatever. The closing is even better, guys. You have a lock, a liner lock. So look at that. And that lock bar runs all the way down here. So you have so much space to push. I can push the lock bar from down here. 
and it'll drop all the way there and then boop i mean it's just awesome and it has great action on the clothes i mean it's just it's such a fun knife to play with uh, absolutely enjoy the action uh no lock rock no freaking blade play none of that stuff um this was 294 dollars. that's a sticking point for some people on this i think is that it's just too expensive for what it is and part of that is the packaging and the collaboration but guys if you're gonna pay that 270 to 290 for a pena trust me it's right up there as long as you're into this size uh, and this bottle opener doesn't annoy you because I know some people they just don't like the look it does not get in the way ergonomically at all not at all um, but some people don't like the look and obviously it is a small size knife I just reviewed the thumb stud rock wall you can see it's even smaller than that uh, which I believe has a three and a quarter inch blade so this one's maybe two point eight or something like that 2.75 on it um but guys absolutely just a home run i think from knife joy but i just i get bored of the the top flippers back flippers i it's like it almost needs to have a hole at this point kyle has corrupted me um it needs to have a hole or multiple deployments or something i don't know but like even this as fun as this is, got a little boring, and I'm not really a traditional guy, and I don't know. So, as much as I love it, I'm going to sell it. But that doesn't mean it's not a fantastic knife. It truly is. And right now in the secondary, I've seen them go for like 200 bucks. I've seen them go for 220 uh, I'm hoping to get more than that. <laughs> but, like, they go for a good price, so you can pick one up on the secondary for a good price and call it a day, right? awesome awesome knife <clears throat> great job knife joy great job esnix great job riot killed it so that is the esnix knife joy beer buster jr can't wait to see what they do in the future i'll probably be buying them so there's that um <clears throat> i hope you guys have an absolutely fantastic day i love you all and i will catch you later